Hey everybody, welcome back to the Arena Productions, and in this video we're diving into a spoiler-filled recap and review of Star Wars The Acolyte Season 1, Episode 5, titled Night. So if you haven't seen the episode yet, consider this your official spoiler warning, because we're going to be breaking down all the major plot points and, and twists, so proceed with caution. So we're, we're now past the halfway mark of The Acolyte, and Episode 5, titled Night, ramps up the tension and stakes significantly. So written by Cora Donna and Cameron Squires and directed by Alex Garcia Lopez, this episode delivers on the action and drama we've been craving. So let's dive into the key moments and revelations. And before we continue, if you like this video, please be sure to hit that like, subscribe, and notification bell for when we drop another episode of The Acolyte, as well as all of our other content here on the Arena Productions. So the episode opens with Osha and her her pip droid waking up to a scene of utter chaos. Last week, we saw the Master fling Osha into the dust, and she awakens surrounded by the bodies of fallen Jedi. The sound of lightsabers clashing leads her to discover that many of the Jedi who arrived on Kofar uh, have been killed. Yord is nearly among them, but Osha's quick thinking saves him temporarily, although it draws the Master's attention to her. Meanwhile, May is watching the, the carnage from Kalnaka's home. Saul intervenes to save her, but May takes matters into her own hands, grabbing Kalnaka's lightsaber and setting out to help. Uh, Saul orders Yord and Osha to return to their vessel, but May faces off against Saul's Padawan, Jackie, who, who wants to see May arrested for her crime. So the big reveal of the episode comes... Uh, as the master taunts Saul during their confrontation, the master whose identity has been shrouded in mystery finally unmasks himself. The master turns out to be uh, Quimere, uh, like who would have thought else, right? But uh, played by Manny Jacinto, confirming many fan theories. This revelation adds a new layer of complexity to the series, especially as Quimere mocks uh, Saul and the Jedi's secrecy. Now, my my stance here is I think that Quimere is still the apprentice. I don't think he's the master. So whether it's either Tentabras, Darth Tentabras, or or Darth Plagueis, uh, we shall see as the series continues. But I still think Quimere is the, the apprentice and not the actual Sith master. But anyway, we'll see what happens. But anyway... Uh, Jackie faces off against uh, Quimere in a fierce lightsaber duel. Despite her impressive skills, Jackie is ultimately overpowered and killed by Quimere in a brutal display. Uh, her death is a significant blow to Saul and underscores the high stakes of their mission. Elsewhere, Osha and Yord rush back to the conflict only for Yord to be swiftly killed by Quimere. His death is sudden and underscores the master's lethal prowess. But what I was a little bit, uh, uh, what I was a little bit uh, disappointed by is the, the how the Jedi were easily killed off. So, but uh, anyway, Osha and Saul confront Quimir again, and the battle intensifies. Quimir plants seeds of doubt in Osha's mind about Saul, alluding to a darkness within him. Osha uses her pip droid to summon giant bugs that carry Quimir away, adding a touch of classic Star Wars whimsy to the intense episode. Uh, so the conflict between Osha and May reaches a boiling point as May uses the force to stun Osha uh, and then disguises herself as her sister. So this switch sets the stage for future complications and drama as May now poses as Osha to further her own plan. So my, my clothing, closing thoughts here, the, the episode five of the Acolyte, it delivers intense action shocking reveals, and deep character moments. The revelation of Quimere as the, as the master or maybe the apprentice <laughs> adds a thrilling twist to the series, and, and the tragic losses of Jackie and Yord highlight the high stakes of the Jedi's mission. Osha and May's ongoing conflict promises even more drama in the episodes to come. So let us know in the comments what you thought of this episode. I mean, it was intense. I mean, the lightsaber battle... Uh, you know, all of the battles with the lightsabers were really cool. And it's like, how was Quimere able to to break uh, some of the kyber crystals 
there for uh you know momentarily for some of the jedi uh was that uh, uh like veskar that he was wearing a little bit it's interesting we'll we'll have to find out but uh let us know in the comments what you thought of this episode and what you think's going to you know happen as we move forward into episode 6 so anyway you know if you enjoyed the video like i said please hit the like subscribe and notification bell and uh make sure to leave your thoughts in the comments uh so anyway until next week, uh, may the force be with you, and we're looking forward to episode six. So take care, everyone. Peace out.